My name is Cassandra. Thank you so much for choosing to check out my grocery haul. I'm headed over to Walmart to pick up items on my weekly grocery list as well as on my Pinterest grocery list because I've been perusing Pinterest for all of the fun spring slash Easter treats that I can make at home with the girlies this week while they're home for spring break. But you know what Pinterest does? It just lengthens your grocery list. So let's head over to Walmart and see how many things I can get checked off my list and then I'll follow that up with a haul. I am leaving Walmart now with what is essentially over $100 of junk food. So if you're looking for health food inspiration, I'm afraid this haul is not it. I'll link my last one. However, because I stocked up at um, a bulk food store um, on my last grocery haul, I really have plenty of proteins and veggies at home. So this is just kind of filler, things for school lunches, things for our spring themed treats. Oh, and sunglasses, really cheap sunglasses. Let's do a try on haul real quick. So I prefer like $10 sunglasses and I like to keep them everywhere. A pair at school, a pair in the car, a pair at home for the pool. So here are my options. Tell me which one. I mean, I'm going to keep them both, but tell me which ones you prefer. This is option number one. I thought these were kind of a cool shape. <laughs> these will probably be my car shades. And then I wanted to get a pair that were all plastic for the pool. So here are sunglasses number two. Also cute, maybe not as cute as the first pair in my opinion, but they will do. I like that they're plastic, they sit down on my nose, um, you know, because in the pool you kind of need a tighter fit. I just have very sensitive eyes. When it's sunny out, I just squint constantly, and I don't know if that's a result of, I want to say I have lighter colored eyes or really have medium colored eyes, so that may contribute to it, but also I've had LASIK, so if it's sunny, I just I have to have on sunglasses or I'll just squint the whole time. My eyes were, will water. If it's super bright, my eyes will start burning. So there's that. Okay, well, let's get home and we'll do the haul. I've organized my Walmart grocery haul into two categories. The first are items that I need for this week's meal plan or like typical weekly grocery shopping items. And then the second part will be uh, the items that I bought for my Pinterest inspired spring themed treats. Let's kick it off with the pantry items. My daughter Evie's favorite all-time cereal is Chocolate Toast Crunch, so I got her that cereal. And then my daughter Issa requested Frosted Flakes with mini marshmallows. I could not find the kind with marshmallows today, so I figure we can just throw some mini marshmallows in with the Frosted Flakes. So, but I did get this giant bag of those. And then if you haven't had this G Hughes brand of sauces or marinades, they're always sugar-free and gluten-free, which I'm gluten-free. I can't eat wheat. I actually went looking for the teriyaki sauce and they didn't have that. So I decided to try this orange ginger marinade. I think this will be good on the chicken and veggie skewers that I'm planning to make this week. I'll marinate the chicken in that. I don't think my children have ever had microwavable rice or if they have it's been years the one time i've tried it i did not like it but this would be faster and easier than making rice in a pot so i bought this one bag for them to try as a side this week so we'll see how that goes off to report back and then i also have some refried beans to go with taco tuesday i've got these ranch style beans for some frito pie which we tend to make if my husband is out of town because he doesn't like beans, like as in he'll gag doesn't like beans. Um, I got, oh, that's in the wrong category. I also got blackberry lemonade and raspberry lemonade. These are the little tubes, they're drink mixes that you put into a bottle of water. These are my two current favorite flavors. This is the Great Value brand, but this is basically comparable to Crystal Light. Okay, over here I got my soda of choice, which is Diet Root Beer. This is the A&W Zero Sugar. This is for lunches for school, and my daughter Issa takes her lunch every single day, and she really likes these individual packs of Pringles, so we got those. Over here, these Lily's baking chips are actually for me. These are lower sugar, or no sugar, they're stevia sweetened 
chocolate chips and I like to put them in um, like cottage cheese and berries and nuts and mix them all together and eat that as a snack. So we have regular chocolate chips. I'm just buying the no sugar added chocolate chips for myself since I've been trying to eat lower in carbs to lose weight. Um, Evie loves cinnamon French toast sticks, especially this one from Walmart. So since I was there, I got those. This honey ham is for Issa's sandwiches for her school lunches. Um, I When I drink tea at home, I like to sweeten it with Sweet and Low. And the last time I bought Sweet and Low, I accidentally got the type that's just one big bag and you scoop it out with this tiny pink spoon. And I really don't like it. So I got um, these pre-packaged, the little packets, individual packets is what I'm trying to say. I have a half gallon of milk here. I have a frozen bag of mixed vegetables. This will be good for either a chicken soup or maybe a beef stew, something like that. I bought these zucchinis to make zucchini boats. I'm going to try to hollow out the middles and put kind of um, taco meat and cheese in the middle to make um, boats. That sounds pretty good to me. At Walmart, we always love to get these original pork sausage patties. They are our favorite. They taste like Sonic to me. I got this for no reason at all other than I thought it would look cute on my kitchen counter. Um, you already saw these two pairs of sunglasses that I got. <clears throat> okay, across the kitchen over here. So I was starving by the time I left Walmart. So I picked up these pistachios, which I ate about half of and promptly spilled the other half and this Diet Mountain Dew, and I had that in the car on my way home. Um, and these are the items that I picked up for the treats that I'm making. So I have a bag of pretzels, I've got some vanilla candy coating, two types of cookies here. These are great value twist and shouts, they're like Oreos. These are Nutter Buddies, Peeps Marshmallows, these little Robin eggs that I only ever see near Easter. I also needed a box of chocolate pudding some pink sanding sugar, and some white icing, or in this case, vanilla frosting. The um, shorts and tank top that I'm wearing today are from Walmart, and you know what? I want to show you a couple of the sundresses that I got at Walmart recently, and the whole point is I didn't get them today on Sunday, but I got them a few days ago, and if you are looking for cute, very affordable, clothing for warmer weather you need to like run to walmart right now because each of the dresses that i got was 12.97 a piece let me show you Aren't they cute and so springy and less than $13? Thank you for watching my Walmart grocery haul. Now hang around to see some of the fun, yummy, and oh so cute spring or Easter treats that me and the girlies made using the ingredients that I picked up at Walmart. <laughs>for joining me today if you enjoyed the video please give it a thumbs up consider subscribing subscribing is absolutely free and if you'd like to receive a notification each time i upload a new video you just click that little bell select all and then you'll get a little notification on your phone each time i upload a new video i typically upload grocery hauls and working mom life motivation content on a weekly basis thanks again for joining me and i'll see you right back here next week in a brand new video